everyone, it's me, Boku Satsun. Here today we're gonna to review, well, this guy, this emo boy. The guy who's so emo that he, well, if you watch Ray Vice, you know what happened to him. <laughs> so today we're here to review the SA Figures Common Rider Evil Bat uh Bat Genome and Jacko Genome. He has two G he has two genome forms. The Bat one and the Jacko one. So yeah. Now let me say this. I had this guy for like what? Since like what this week? And man, he's man, he's so good to play with. Well I was saying this I'll say like well, I think I think what was it? What was it? What was it? What? Last week I think it was. Man. You don't see the pictures though. I have so many good pictures of this guy, but man. He's he oop, my bad. He's uh He's pretty fun though, that's for sure. So let's go on and talk about the good, the bad, what I like, and what I do like about the figure. All right, so articulation is right. How's he good for like crunch for like abs? Well, this is how far he goes for his abs. Let me, let me, let me move this up for a second. This is how far he goes. This, sorry, this is how far he goes for his abs. But how good his arms? Pretty good. I'm not a big fan of this. I don't know, this feels like it's a little bit loose in my copy, so if anyone's having the same problem with me, be careful because you don't want that to break. It almost reminds me of Cross Dragons because I like my Cross Dragon figures. One of my favorite figures of last year, but but uh, that figure's shoulder piece popped off a lot for me, so yeah. So how good is he for his arm? Well, I'll right, show you about him though. His arms are really, t his arms are like really good. And they're like double elbow peg, it looks like. That's actually really good. I love to see that in my figures. Because it'll be way harder for, it'll be way harder for the figure to break. <laughs> how good for his knees? Oh, well, this is, oh, this is how far he goes for his knees. You can put him like in a pose if you want. Something like this. There you go. <laughs> Not the best pose, but uh, it's something for now. See? You're putting that pose right there. Let's talk about the scope first. The scope. I gotta say that I actually like this scope. I know it looks just like the one for the actual show. I get that, but god damn. This look like the suit this look like the suit just came out of the show. Man, it is so good. <laughs> This is one. This has, this this guy apparently became one of my favorite figures of this year. But man, um, oh God, this is so beautiful. I love it. And Demon and Genius are coming out this year or this month as well. I will review Genius. Don't worry. <laughs> I will review Genius. Oh man, this is a this is really good. So, uh, so let's talk about his belt for a second. This is the two slash driver right here. When it when is uh when when it shows the blade like this, this means that Kagero is in charge of the body. Well, in, that, that means Kagero is holding the driver. But if you take this off and show this piece right here, this means Daiji is in charge of the body. You take it off nice and slowly off the well driver right here. Make sure you don't break it too. I had the Jackal Genome on him because, well, he had that through the whole show. So, <laughs> yeah. And I do have the Jackal form on me, by the way. So, don't worry. I will show, I will show that. 
So, uh, yeah, let's go on to accessory. Oh boy, we have a lot of accessories for this guy. Where should I start? All right. So, I show you the Jacko Vi stamp. Here's the here's the here's the here's the pterodactyl one. And this one's based on Fies, by the way. Just want to FYI to all the Fies fans out there. And here we have the chest piece for the Jacko and uh, well helmet. I'll show you. So, how you guys been doing? For me, well, I've been doing alright. I've been uh, reading. I have. I went back and finished reading the dub, the freaking uh, double manga. I finished it, eighteen chapters. I know there's more, but the but the rest I was using only went up to eighteen. So yeah. And here, here, with the jackal gene, here, here in the jackal form, I know, it has this bat, it has this freaking bat gene, I'm, I'm gonna keep that in there, but, here he is, in the jackal form. I like this form, but, but at the same time, I kind of like the, I, I actually prefer him in his base form more, so, yeah. First off, for people that say that, people say that, people will say this, when this, when this was announced, when this form was announced for evil, people thought it looked like X. People thought it looked like Gam or Ryuga. I want to clarify: it doesn't look like both. It looked like an actual Jacko. It looked like an actual Jacko. So, yeah, you're welcome. All right, let me uh. Let me put this back in here. And, uh, alright. Alright. Sorry, this video's everywhere, by the way. <laughs> Being lost in how to record a tour video. Well, that's not true. Last month, I. What was it? Last month or this month? I think last month I recorded a freaking uh Zen Kaiser review. Then did Kabuto says then did a Kabuto review on my podcast. But right, go check out go, go check out my podcast by good stuff on there. So So we have this piece for the gun. If you take out this blade piece this blade part right here, you put in this, and pretty much Daiji's in charge of, of the body, I said. <laughs> Think about, it's a two slash driver, and the driver has two personalities, Daiji and Kagero's. So, yeah. Well, all right, so we have, so let's see, what, let's see what we have for hands. Oh, we have we had two open palm hands. We had two somewhat. We had two somewhat. Oh my bad. We had two somewhat openish, open grabbyish hands. You kind of say, well, they, they look like grabbyish hand, but not really. At best, Drew can say that. Two fisted hands! <laughs> uh, I was kidding, I was kidding, I was kidding. We have, we have, a number, we have another open, open hand for the weapon. And another free, and another uh, relaxed hand as well. Because, well, he only has his one relaxed hand there. So, yeah. So let's do so I put it, let's put up those up so I can talk. Let's do some uh, size comparison because oh boy we have a lot to compare him with. So get it out of the way first. Let's put him next to Revy and Vice. His Vice. And 
And here's Revy. Poop my bad. Oh, yeah. He scales pretty well with them. Not gonna lie. That's pretty good to hear. Right. Here he is with a few Sentai. Here he is with Zenkaiser. Come on, Stan. Why would he not Stan? What the heck? Hold on. And here he is with uh with the lightning collection we so red. Yeah, he's pretty much a little bit taller, you can kinda of see. I don't know. He scales pretty well with both of them. That's pretty. That's pretty impressive. <laughs> well, again, the Japanese figures, American figure, and at times the Japanese figures are a little bit more shorter, smaller than the American figures. So here he is with, uh, with my boy Menemy, Fujigura, Fujigura. By the way, I just started reading the I just start reading the manga for Jujutsu Kaisen yesterday, last night, and I'm having a blast. But I put that on hold because right now I'm rewatching Real Soldier for my podcast. So yeah. And here we have Valkyrie. <laughs> yeah, of course she's way more smaller. <laughs> Oh yeah, one last thing for inception. Forgot to show it, but uh, we have this hammer right here that you can that you can give device and Revy. I totally forgot that. I totally forgot that he has this thing. All right, for the last side comparison, we have Hirobi. and we have the Moon of Shadows. Who's looking for Black Sun? I love this figure. One of my favorites for this year, though. So, yeah. I'm going to move down the way. So, overall, what do I think of this figure? Oh, I love it. <laughs> I can't wait for Demons to come out because Demons going to be a blast taking pictures with him fighting pictures. Demon gonna be a black for taking pictures of well demons fighting this guy. <laughs> oh man, that could be fun. So overall, if you love Kamen Rider, if you love Wave Ice, I recommend you pick him up. I will say this, he's premium Bandai, so if you didn't pre-order, good luck finding him. He's pretty I already know that he's pretty hard to find the market. But hey, if but hey. If you get lucky and find one, then good for you. So yeah, yeah, that's all I'm gonna say. My name is Broku, and I'm, I'm out. Please like, comment, subscribe, follow all my social media in the description, and be stay tuned for and stay tuned for my next podcast episode on the broadcast, which will be which will, which will be on well, we're a soldier. <laughs> and my like my next like, and keep it keep an eye out for my next like Dragon Ball Xenoverse two video as well. I'm working on that as we speak, so yeah. <laughs> Till next time, guys. My name is Broku, and I'm out. Bow. I'm out. <laughs> My name is Broku, and I'm out. Bye. Enjoy the pictures.
fire. 